My name is Mike Gresser, the University of St. Thomas, class of 1991. I'm the uh, owner and president of Gresser Companies, Inc. We're a specialty contractor for commercial construction in concrete and masonry, and we do work throughout the Midwest. The company was founded in 1969 by my parents in the basement of our home. Uh, my father was a bricklayer. Uh, I started working for the company in uh, 1991, and uh, I've had roles including risk management, safety management, sales, project management, and I'm now the president, CEO, and sole shareholder of the company. The family business program at St. Thomas was introduced my junior year, and I was actually in the, the first year of that program. And I found it very interesting because we were able to approach relatives that were in the family business and ask them to join us in the class. And uh, I joined that class and we had a small group, about 10 students, and I was very impressed at the quality of the students and the seriousness uh, versus my other classes. These are people who had figured out what they wanted to do with their lives and that they wanted to excel at it. And uh, this course really offered them an opportunity to, uh, to advance in, in their field. I think what we learned most through the family business program was that businesses have life cycles and stages. Uh, there's an entrepreneurial stage, which my father had excelled at. But for success in the second generation, it takes more of a professional management aspect and approach. And the family business program made us realize that there are tried and true methodologies for succeeding as a family business and for making the transition into the next generation. And that included an outside board of advisors and professionals for us to fall back on. And uh, we really established a roadmap for the transition and a time frame and expectations for both of us. It taught us in the class that the preceding generation really at times gets pushed aside and that oftentimes that's what's feared the most by the selling or founding generation. And in our case, we found out that that was indeed a fear that my father had, and he still, even though he'll turn 80 this February, still has an involvement in the business. He still sells for us, he still uh, is around when he wants to be, and it's a, been a wonderful transition. And I think without the program, I, I would have never realized how important that that emotional attachment might be, uh, and in our case, it's really helped. I think it's important if a student wants to enter the family business to realize that it's not the easy road, that the family business at times has greater challenges than going out in the general business world does, and that if you're going to be committed, that you have to really commit as a family member. Family members are watched more closely than any other new employees, and more is asked of family members in a business. Uh, than of non-family members if they're truly going to succeed. You can get your job in the family business, but to succeed as a leader in your family business, it, it takes more than one would expect. And I think that the program prepares you for that, and I think that people should go in with eyes wide open, definitely. I had the opportunity to come back and teach uh, in the program for a few years and, and guest lecture, and that really made me reflect on all the things that I had learned and uh, looking back on it, it was amazing how quickly the time had flown and allowed me to, uh, I think, impart some knowledge on the, on the students that were there when I lectured. And I think also, uh, just in general, it made me realize that in business, you need outside resources. You need people to help you along on your journey. Most of it's been done before. Most, uh, most of the obstacles you face have been faced. And it really created a resource ongoing for me to be able to fall back on. That's what makes St. Thomas unique in general. St. Thomas has professors with real experience out in the world and have been there and done that in a business setting. And the family business program was no exception to that. We really had real world resources to fall back on and to learn from. And uh, I think that makes St. Thomas unique. The University of St. Thomas, ahead of the curve.